Hello, welcome to Tuesday. Uh, we're back with some overhead work as we've been doing throughout this cycle. Okay, we're gonna start off again with strict press as we've been doing. Uh, every two minutes, we're doing five sets of three reps and we're building, okay? Strict press, remember, when we step out, we do not use our lower body. We keep our legs locked out, we squeeze our butt and core, we press straight up, head goes through the shoulders, rinse and repeat, okay? If you get and you're pressing and we can't finish, we're gonna come down and use that dip drive to finish our work, okay? Um, after we get through with that strict press, making small jumps building, remember strict press, we're not gonna get super heavy with that. It's our most limiting overhead movement. We're then gonna go into every 90 seconds, going through a few sets of our push jerk. Okay, and these will be percentage based. Whenever we do our percentages with every day, if you don't have a one rep max, you're just building off what you've done in the past. Okay, push jerks, we're being very explosive. We're gonna dip and drive like we always do with a press, but then we're going to re-catch underneath the bar, okay? So when I step out, that same dip drive, and then I jump, press underneath, I stand all the way up and reset. So again, we dip drive, press underneath, stand, and that's my lift. When we finish all that pressing, um, we have a fun workout, a lot of moving pieces. We're mixing in the D balls again. We're mixing in the assault bikes. We also have some burpees, okay? So the first part is gonna be three rounds of assault bike and D ball to the shoulder. So remember with these, depending on the weight you use, you wanna drop your hips, okay? We wanna get low, bring it into our hips, bring it up and drop back down. So the heavier or lighter that is, you can use sandbags as well. We wanna make sure we're keeping our hips low and propelling that power on the way up. Okay, so you're gonna go three rounds of that. Every round you finish the bike and the D-ball, you're gonna rest one minute. So the intensity should be high because you're being rewarded with rest. When you finish all three rounds, we're gonna keep the bike, the calories will go down, and we're gonna do burpees over our bar, okay? And the same rules will apply. You'll do one round of the bike and burpees, you'll rest a minute, and we'll do that three times, 20 minute cap for the whole piece. When we do burpees over the bar, depending on the size of class, we can do lateral or we can do bar facing. Today, just for lateral, for spacing, we go all the way down, we hop up, we jump over the bar, okay? We do not need to stand all the way up when we do that. If we were facing, the same rules would apply. I would face the bar and I jump with two feet. I turn and repeat. As I said, 20 minute cap for that whole piece. Have fun with it. I'll see you tomorrow.